and welcome back to an episode of Black Bullet. Last time, it was an interesting scene. <laughs> and, uh, that's least be said. But we also found out at the end that the Pussy Slayer, well, no, nobody knows Pussy Slayer, Prostitute Slayer, is still out there. It wasn't not that goddamn asshole looking doctor thingy. Retired doctor, actually. So, with that said, let us begin in 3, 2, 1, go. This song I remember to turn on the Japanese. Japanese uh, dub before actually starting. Okay, it's a killer. I uh, kind of was questioning between the killer or... Oh, Jack the Ripper. I was questioning it be Sebastian or the killer. It is the killer. That's not a good idea. <laughs> that is not fair. Except for physics, but then again, you guys just uh, will have uh, magic. Yeah, that's what chat goes. If you don't pay attention for like at least one move, you die. Put a smile on that face. I tried to find the perfect face and cut it out. Yep. Mm, everything seems to be working, recording. Also recording. Bam 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 bam. <laughs> <sighs> Today I fucking live stream for about one and a half hours on Twitch. It wasn't much. It was just for me just fucking around. Well, uh, trying to draw actually. Half of the stream was dedicated to something. One drawing, then the other to another thing. Because I couldn't choose which one to do. Good, didn't know what to do. Really, from the beginning. Potentina Rager Rago Groger His blur chance encounter Maybe. Yeah. For your own area. Yep. So it's less about revenge, but it's teaching the people, just like the Mandarin, I guess. Mate, no, not really. I don't really like the Mandarin. What the fuck was it again? Uh, what saw? Jigsaw. Okay. Uh, 
Đấy. You look dead. Kind of looks like a loose there. Are you suggesting a demon? Human. So there's a demon out there. You never specified pers <laughs> that every everyone, including demons, monsters. Ah. Well, sometimes you're too serious and direct. Yes. <laughs> oh dear, I'll find the goddamn cat. <laughs> oh, that's an attack. Blood already. PTSD? Nope, you just you probably mix with between PTSD and not able to go against blood. And gore. Huh. Okay. Two, two personalities. That is true. Okay. <laughs> oh, it's you! So you're the redhead one. Neutral. Oh. Yeah, I guess it's neutral. Auntie. So everybody in this house has a goddamn demon, I'm gonna presume. Yeah. 
Yes! Don't worry yourself. Yep. Okay. What kind of surgery was it? You have to kill him? Why did you have to get that fucking chainsaw? Why do you even have a chainsaw? It's a chainsaw. No, that's a sit chainsaw. That's not a sickle. I think the excuse is a sickle because there's goddamn hooks on it. May I punch you? Red blood is a good color, but you don't need to paint it with it. Hey, guess I like it. <laughs> Maskus. Okay. My lord, though. Sorry, a chance encounter. You, it was planned encounter. <laughs> And have you brought your silverware, Sebastian? Oh, you have a knife. Don't tell me what to be the most beautiful woman in the country. Did you? Did you want to inherit the estates and everything with it?
so it's not an auntie, but a sister? No, no, okay. Is it? And you're dead. Yeah, he's... He's a Grim Reaper. Yep. Film rolls? Memory? So judgment of heaven or hell. Or oh I could tell. Dramatic okay. Still with the record. Okay, so they weren't born into the country. Did he cheat on her? I'm pregnant. Yep, she saw her away. Miscarriage? You don't see a child, so it's maybe a miscarriage. Miscarriage! Oh, wow! So you can't get in the hair or in child anymore. So that's why you snipped some woman's wombs. You lost all your future to be loved ones and your loved ones current. Red takes away stuff, but after it takes away. So she had an abortion. I see. I see. I see her motive. Hi, Grell. Look like his father. Everything you have left. We 
because life fucks you. <sighs> life just comes this way. It happens. Everything can be predetermined. Or isn't. But we can't prove it. Isn't this gonna cause an uproar in the city? Like a really influ a really big person died. But I'm a demon. <laughs> One hell of a boat. Are you really divine? You're supposed to be neutral. So you're neither divine or satanic. You are a natural, a yokai. Can I the Reaper? I was sure it's only one. Being one incarnation of the Reaper. Like, yes. Uh, so, yeah, maybe. So, so, so you have to rethink shit. If you kill the Green Reaper, no one will be able to go to heaven or hell. And the concept of death could dwindle and go away. Or. Death is still there, but more like the souls of people will still be stuck on the in this world. Two interpretations of killing Grim Reaper: no death, or no more going to hell or heaven. You're just stuck on this planet, in this universe, in this plane of existence. Uh, I don't know the I don't the cross dressing at Grill was season two stuff. I guess I get I guess wrong. Uh madame The fuck was that? That's the at the funeral. Wait now. I see. I see where Madame is kind of coming from, but mm. it's kind of natural that people. Grief about what they've lost, losing everything they love, family members, all that. It's just in this moral statement, like in this quote unquote average normal, considering the whole human population, at least in the uh, where I'm living, it's not a good way. That and it, 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 this episode explains why the uterus. 
makes sense now. It's... Uh, how do you even remove the uterus with the baby from a woman in Victorian times? Hmm. The moment I saw her pregnant, I knew it was a miscarriage. And I knew, at the moment I saw her fall in love with the goddamn guy that proclaimed the seal, obviously she's not getting the guy. But I guess it's not cheating. It's just... He got just married to the oldest person. And it kind of makes sense, I would say. Because I think you would want your oldest daughter to marry off, off first to the uh, most powerful and influential person. Like the uh, Hive family. <sighs> Every single... That, her life was the, in my eyes, the definition of hell. I consider this world, this plane of existence, to be heaven and hell. And hers was more on the hell side. She always got a glimmer of hope. But her hope always snuffed away. Best way to create despair, guys. Best way. Take notes. That's how you got that fucking make somebody crazy. But uh, but 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 uh, more serious terms. Don't go uh, go around killing people or uh, take out their uteruses while they are pregnant. <sighs> yeah. She. People have diff. People also have different views on life and children. Especially nowadays, there's also a lot of people. There's two factions about abortions and just babies. One just doesn't want it to be aborted, and you just had to be more responsible and wear protection. The other one just said it's pro choice. If you don't want the baby, just get it out. She was definitely not pro choice. It's just people have different things. You lost. Your husband, so you wanted to love someone else. You got that. You uh, were uh, you were loving, got, going to love your child, but she lo lost it. Lost that. People put. It, it's just this. People have different norms after experiencing things. That woman, that prostitute, probably didn't experience like actual miscarriage. She probably just got the abortion every single time she got pregnant. And she's fine with that because, one, she didn't really need anyone to love. She probably values val valued her uh, money, income, over the child in her uh, uterus, uh, in in her in her womb. I mean, and uh, so yeah, if she probably if the prostitute had a miscarriage with someone she loved, she will definitely ch also change her mind to. The mind of Madame Red. It's it's just all situational. We humans are all reactionary. We everything we do is a reaction. Everything we do is a reaction to the past. So, but with that theory, if everything is a reaction, does that mean we don't have a control over what we do? Because the past is set in stone, we can't change it. And, it. and even if we can change it, we'll create a loop. This whole world could be just a loop. The Big Bang could have predicted the whole future up until now, and far millions, billions, infinite years in the future. We just don't know, we don't have enough information. Or calculations or formulas to predict that. I, I, I do not blame Madame Red going crazy. It's the situation, not the person. Yes, some people may have reacted differently, but that's because your brain is built differently than Madame Red. Some people may have even done it more intensely, try to. Uh, 
actually kill the whole country just because of her suffering. Or every single woman, or blame the men, because prob that was probably the carriage I rammed into them. Or some may accept the death better than her. Well, she prob she did accept the death of her child and her sister. It's just that one prostitute that didn't put value on life of the future that ticked her over. You don't know what's ha gonna happen in the future. You don't know if your choices actually matter. You don't know anything. The one thing you should do is just exist. And what plane you are. Well, with that said, that's it for this episode of Black Butler. And I will see you guys next time. Bye bye.